Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. Good news for Andy Murray fans. That's right, light at the end of a long comeback tunnel as Andy posted a image on Instagram which uh, is sending a signal that brighter days just may be ahead. The three-time Grand Slam champion has been training since shutting down his season after Shenzhen in September. Murray told the British media that he's heading to Miami for about a month of training in the heat to prepare for the Australian summer in January. Now he says he's getting closer and closer. Andy underwent right hip surgery on January 8th, missing a total of 11 months. Though he had some success in his comeback, including knocking off British number one Kyle Edmund, Murray said his season is purely about regaining his health and his fitness. Now ranked at number 263, Andy says after a month of fitness work in Miami, he plans to arrive in Brisbane a week early to acclimate for his 2019 season opener. Murray says he's been practicing already for a few days. He's still got a couple of months to get himself ready for the start of the tournament season. Now, while Andy is healing, the LTA is hurting. The LTA is going to lose nearly $10 million this year and is facing a financial black hole for 2019, according to the BBC. Citing LTA regional briefing documents, the BBC reports that British tennis over the last two years has lost $16 million. However, the LTA says that figure is wildly inaccurate. Pointing to cash reserves, the LTA says its 2019 bottom line should be much healthier than what has been reported. The organization's bottom line numbers are expected to be released in April of next year. Part of the reason for the projected losses is a temporary reduction in revenues from Wimbledon. Wimbledon has been pouring funds into constructing a new roof over Court 1. That's scheduled to open in 2019 when Wimbledon revenues are expected to rise again. And that's our news for now, everybody. I'm Grace Carter. We'll see you next time.